So uh, here we have the original unit, which uh, you can see from the paintwork, it's been up about six years. So we're going to have a quick look at it, strip it down, try and make some improvements. Certainly changing lights to LEDs. Uh, one of the things we've noticed that your bearing is quite stiff, so it's not turning into the wind as it should. But that'll drop of oil and it'll be ready again. So let's get busy. So it's been in the harsh weather. We're noticing as we're stripping it down immediately some of the materials are quite brittle because of what the sun's done. So we're going to have to see what sort of condition it is in and whether it whether it even will work again. Okay, so we've got it stripped and we're just looking at the main bearings. There is a tiny, tiny bit of movement. You can't see it, but you can maybe just hear it. So that's the main bearings. If that was on the engine and you was uh, wanting to go to work with this thing and be reliable for as a vehicle, you would probably look to change them. But because it's uh, it's lasted so long and it is only a slight slight movement, we'll just get some new oil in it and we'll keep it as it is, but obviously keep an eye on it at the next service. So we saw the yaw bearing was very stiff and it is, it's uh, obviously just got water in there as it's rained. It does turn so we'll get some some release, releasing oil in there and some oil and we'll get that spinning smooth again. So we put the oil on the your bearing five minutes ago it's already well it's working working fine so it's not an issue there anymore that was the only real problem we saw um, if we go to look inside there's um, a tiny bit of oil left but nothing to get excited about and it it will be getting a new fill of oil as we saw from the condition of the other tail unit using ply, it was well weathered, so we, we're going to have a look at using some metal. Get them U bolts drilled, holes Steel. for the. Steel, steel bolts, I Steel they? bolts drilled, mounted, and then we'll look at a, a vein, a tail vein for it. So we've got the. Got the bits and pieces, done the upgrades, and got the new lights, it's good to go, get the uh, front end on. So we've got it running now. We obviously changed the shape and size of the tail, air, tail area, so we need to just confirm that everything's alright. And then see what the lights are looking like in the dark. Any questions, got any more info, any other parts, just let us know in the usual way. Thanks for watching.